Well, my name is Brent, and you're watching Steam Culture, and today we are talking about grain elevators. Now, grain elevators are those iconic and massive structures that sort of dot the Midwest, storing grain for all kinds of different uses, but they didn't exist until the mid-1800s. Now, about that time, farming was becoming a cash crop because of uh, mechanized farming, and farmers needed a way to uh, get their grain to market, and one of the ways was the Erie Canal, provided a way to get the grain to Buffalo. Well, in Buffalo, a gentleman by the name of Joseph Dart, uh, inventor, lawyer, friend of the farming industry, and he looked at these grain elevators and thought there was a better way to do it. So here's what he was trying to improve upon. Boat comes up to the grain elevator, and all the grain that's down in the hull has to be physically lifted by guys with shovels to the top of the ship. From there, a manual series of buckets on some pulleys would take the grain uh, into the elevator and then to be taken up into all these different sorting bins. So he thought there's a better way to do this. So he developed a sprocket and chain system and hooked on that chain and pulleys was buckets. So he mechanized the process using steam. He put in a steam boiler and a steam engine and he drove that sprocket and chain system with buckets. But here's where he really differentiated himself. Instead of having laborers down in the ship bring the grain topside, then to be taken into the mill by the hopper. He made two hoppers, or what they would call marine legs. There was a mechanized leg that took the grain um, into the elevator, but he also made a mechanized leg that went down into the, you know, into, down into the hull of the ship, uh, a bucket system to bring the grain up, and that invention still exists today. They now go down into the ship, have done it ever since, and bring the grain up from the hull of the ship. So, Pretty cool invention. It was the world's first steam-driven grain elevator, and the um, and the leg that goes into the ship invention still exists today. I thought that was pretty cool. So maybe you knew about that, but if you didn't, you know now because you watch Steam Culture. So go out and Google Darts Elevator. And while you're out there, go find us because we have great content for you each and every week. I will go right now as we speak and get to work on next week's episode. So without further ado, see you.